so we're at Dirt Water Door. This is our pitch, fully serviced pitch. Gonna put the canopy out tomorrow. Got our water, nice bit of grass around the back. So electric. And there's our drainage. All good and bonus is it's flat. Might not look it on the camera, but it is spot on. So that's the touring pitch. I'll walk around it again later on. As you can see, it's full of motorhomes and caravans. And this is the bottom part of the uh, touring pitches. So you've got your recycling and general waste there. And that there is a public toilet where it services all the people that come in. It's going to do all door. But at the top of the touring pitches, there's a toilet and a shower for the campsite. And now off to have another look at Doodle Door. We went swimming early one today, but I didn't get any footage because there's too many people about. So this is before you get down to Doodle Door. Um, if you do come here, be prepared to be walking down a big slope up there you've got that's a shop and then you've got a two food wagons and one of them was doing a, a great line in pizzas today and then looking out over the water all the way across the bay so a little bit more I'm actually stood sort of like flat so that's how steep this is and keep the camera Come around here and that is steep as so I'm not too sure what this one's called I've got a funny feeling this might be the uh, man of war beach but tomorrow I intend to come down here and go snorkeling and try and get some footage from under the water which is pretty clear pretty good Best I've seen in the UK anyway. And the door is just the other side of there. So that's where we're gonna go around and try and get a picture of that. But we have been down there today and I have swam underneath that today. And there are still some people in there swimming now. We might just be able to pick them out down there. Fair play to them. Lovely. There's the happy wife. So here we are, and there it is, Dirtle Door. So we're down there today. So that water is really, really clear. Best I've seen in the UK. And just there is about a hundred steps. No banister either side, so a bit dodgy if you're not very good on your feet. But well worth it. Glad we came. Yep, we're still living the dream. Well, I am anyway. <laughs> I can't tell if you can see because we're starting to lose the light now because it's getting on. Um, but up there are grass pitches that are part of the holiday park, um, very unlevel and what people complain about is the pitches don't have a divide between them and then this car park which during the day is packed. Now yeah they've got a great view out over the sea especially now when there's nothing in the car park but during the day this car park is absolutely rammed. So I haven't got much of a view then. So I'm quite pleased of uh, having the pitch that we've got and where we've got it. Abbey Field carried on. It's getting a bit late now. What time is it? It's 
10. It's quarter to 10, so I'm losing light, so quality might be a bit crap. So, can't hear any now, but during the day these trees are all full of rooks that are squawking about. I'm glad that we're not underneath the trees. Didn't really want to get the motor home covered in shit. You can see this low lighting. You can see me walking. And we've got some, what do you call those? Pods. Pods. You've got some pods there for people to go in. I don't know what they've got in them, but you can rent them as well. Just beds. Yeah. That's packed here. Nice two six. Another nice two six. And here we are, back home. Good morning, welcome back to the channel. So, we're still in the door, and we're now going over to Low Wolf Cove. Um, this is the view. as well as you can see by the way it's uh, rippling the water a walk to Lake Worth Cove and then back so we got to walk all the way down there and then walk all the way back yet yeah. there she is uh, you are struggling It's nice though, like, if you look out there and see, it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. There's a few people out there on paddle boards already. Right, lovely. So, we've made it down there. Just got to make it back up there now. Car park's filling up. And that's the hill that we've got to walk back up yet. Yeah. Lovely.
come to Low Earth Co without getting an ice cream. Go eat it quicker because it's fucking melting. Mm mm. Dead or door, these sort of pods that you can hire. I think they I don't know what they've got inside them, I'm not going to check because there's someone here. But you have got a nice veranda outside where you've got your own picnic bench. And just over there is Dead or Door Beach. block and some larger pods what sort of like chalets Busy, but nice and clean, tidy. Nice pint of Amstel Shandy. Wife's got a gin, because she's an alcoholic. Very, very nice and clean and tidy. Nice seating there outside. That's a convenience store there. Which has got loads of stuff in it. It's got its own little off license. Lots of food, freezer cabinets. Really, really nice. And that's the area where you pull up. You've got a reception area, but you don't have to go in there. You park up, you phone them, and they come out to you and deal with you, which is really, really good. Really, really can't knock the staff here. 